Well, that's an old one, isn't it? This is way back to like season one. I've actually watched all of Family Guy up through season 10, episode 17 or so. I have them all on the Mac, but that's on TBS, I think. Anyways, it is 10.33 p.m. I kind of pulled another one of those days like yesterday, and I apologize again for that. Anyways, now I'm kind of doing catch-up work, um, topping off fluids in the car and stuff. I'm going to the wrong place. I am looking for coolant, which is over here. Uh, I think this is still good. I got this a couple months ago. It's the Fitty Fitty antifreeze coolant. Uh, it looks like I'm down about very, very, very little. No warning lights or anything, but I'm just taking a look at everything under the hood. Filters are good. Just doing my routine maintenance, and I'm going to top that off a little bit. So I went to school today. Today was good. Uh, that exam I studied for yesterday was 33 questions. I can pretty much guarantee about 30 of them. It was really, really good. Now, I'm not going to say easy, but it was so logical. That's what I love about physics, is it's a science with math. I'm not big into math. But give me a formula, and then it's just substituting variables and solving. So uh, that is very logical to me, and I think I did well. I got the point for the, uh, the, the workbook that I filled out. So that's good news. So I'll uh, get plus one, so exam one in physics is, is good. This is my coolant. It is supposed to be right here in between those two lines, and it is about here. So a very small amount. I'm going to fill that up now. That is the kind of car maintenance I like. Very, very, very easy. It took very little to get it right in between those two arrows. So that is excellent. Nice and full. Uh, Colt got his video up today on his 01540, so check that out. It's on E39 Source. It's a few minute video. Uh, basically went over the car. A couple comments I want to talk about. I doubt they're from anybody here on the vlogging side of things. Um, he bought the car knowing that it has issues and it's a project car that he's going to work on for months to potentially years to come to make it stock, to make the thing you know, look like uh, an E39 with 30,000 miles on it. And I fully believe that he will do that. No question, that'll look just as good or better than that in the upcoming years, months, whatever it is. So the comments that say that's the biggest POS BMW I've ever seen, there's only one of those, and I, I think I, I replied to it in a very eloquent fashion. Uh, if you've got time, please go ahead and read my comment on that. I, I spent a few minutes on it. Um, yeah, so there's that. I mowed today, and I need gas. I'm out of gas again for the mower. I did those other two across the street. So today, all in all, was pretty productive. I had that two-hour off period. I talked to Colt for like an hour and 20 minutes about the car. Pulling out the wires for the DSP amp yesterday did not solve the problem. So now we're on to stage, what is this now, four, stage three or four. We pulled out the dice module and the CD changer. So we'll see if, if uh, the problem exists over there. You probably can't see, but it's actually raining a little bit out here. It's very comfortable temperature-wise, about 60, but it's raining a little bit. Um, so I guess that's okay. So now the only yard I have to do this week is mine. It's supposed to rain tomorrow, like 30% chance, so I'm gonna try to get a ride in the Kent so I don't have to get the car all crapped up again and then have to clean it, so. Uh, I don't really have a whole lot else to say. My maintenance is done. I'm gonna have to get gas. That can go all the way back down in the basement. Wheels are probably dirty, not too bad. Not great, but not nearly as bad as they were. So, apologize for kind of ranting again. Maybe I'll find something else to do tonight before I go to bed. It is 10 o'clock. I'd like to get to bed early, but I don't have a class tomorrow till 11, so that means up at like 9.30, and that'll be nice. It is nice that the windows work in the car when the key is out, as long as you don't open any doors, so I can do that. It actually didn't beep, and it doesn't beep. Probably won't beep on the unlock either. Nope. When I do that with the windows, it doesn't beep until I open the door again. Strange. So to anybody that's on the E39 source that has a car, um, two of my main friends, Bobby and Colt, right now have the 525, the 03 525 Bobby, and the 01 540 Colt, and then me with the M5. Uh, but anybody else, there's a bunch of other people on the channel. I've got maybe 10 intro videos, or we've got maybe 10 intro videos on there of people introducing their cars and it kind of seems like most everybody not everybody but a lot of people just make that intro video and then they kind of disappear and I understand that you can't always be fiddling with the car and it's kind of a nuisance to go out and make a video and film it and then upload it somewhere but you are very much encouraged and more than welcome to make an update of the car how's it going what are you planning to do in the future have you made any changes um, make a little update video give us another little walk around thing any changes you've made let me know. Uh, I love putting more content on there, and I know that people like watching it. So 
Send me some DMs, PMs, texts, whatever. Well, Meg looks a little different. At least just like that. Anybody else watch Family Guy? <laughs> you know it's the end of the day when messages is open, the smooth jazz is on, and this vlog, when it's done, will go in that folder. Fun fact, did you know that I have kept every single video that I have made... Where's my mouse? It's upside down. There it is. Every single video I've made since December 1st, 2009, which happened to be a Tuesday. So there's a bull of a watch review and vlog day... The first day I started, 1-1-10. If you didn't know, I did 55 days before these vlogs started and we're on 5 or 6.58 or whatever, 6.59. So every single video I've made is there. And yes, if you're wondering, the size of that folder is ginormous. Uh, it's 524.19 gigabytes. <laughs> 524.19 gigs. Absolutely huge. So everything's in there. Anyways, that's it for today. Tomorrow's Tuesday, the 2nd. Hope your October started off well, as, long as, as well as the new work week. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good night.